amazing. It's one of the best meats that I had on this whole barbecue. Wow. I would say you're the best. Thank you. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This weekend, we're going to one of my gems here in Southern California is Ojai. We're going to be staying at the Tanquito Inn Suites. Um, there's not much hotels up there. Ojai Valley Inn is very, very difficult to get a reservation for, but we'll be going there for an event um, for the Yankee Silverton and Friends. It's going to be an amazing event for our friends. It's going to be a barbecue. Um, it's going to make an hour and a half. It's going to be amazing for those who like to see the videos uh, on that. Uh, some of you guys might not know Nancy Silverton, I live in Southern California, one of the best chefs in the United States, James Peter, the award winner of 2014, which is you know, one of the best chefs in the United States. Uh, and she had pizzeria, uh, pizzeria and mozza, it's very famous, known for that as well, uh, Italian food. And she started, the uh, most famous thing she just got to start with the Red Bakery, it's a very, very popular place down in Southern California. It's a legendary place for food and bakery and uh, did a phenomenal job with the bread, obviously with the bread. So thanks again guys. If you guys like stuff like this, you like food, you like travel, please like and smash that like button and consider subscribing. So so this event's gonna be pretty exciting. Spirits, food, barbecue, Nancy Silverton, obviously very famous for all the things we do in the Kevin Bledsoe's from Bledsoe's Bar and uh, Joe Kalina from Sumo Dog, Nick uh, Freddy from Freddy's Barbecue, Jerry from all the Park Barbecue, Cake Time represent, Bruce Adelis from Adelis Sausage, and the Nancy Oaks from Boulevard. Oh, it's a very good restaurant house in Northern California. And uh, yeah, super excited. Starts at 1 30, uh, ends at 4 30. It's just going to be a situation where we're going to be drinking, eating, it's going to be outdoor at the farmhouse in Ojai Valley Inn. Um, phenomenal venue and uh, super excited. So hope you guys will uh, come with me. Please guys like this video and please consider subscribing if you love food and travel. We're about to check in here at the Chantico Inn and Suites. We got this at hotel tonight. I think it was about under $300. Uh, not, many, too, not too many uh, hotels in Ohio. I think there's only 12 hotels. And this has 22 suites, so I'll let you know exactly what this is all about. Day has come, Nancy Silverton and friends, amazing barbecue, so let's take a look here. Super excited, I think there's eight restaurants here that get represented. And it's open bar and food and just an amazing venue here at the farmhouse in the Ojai Valley Inn. Comment below, what's your favorite drink? I am waiting for a drink here, they have a really good Guys, if you like food, like this video, consider subscribing. I release a video once a week about food and travel. Hey, my name is Stephen Jung. I am an entrepreneur, but I do love traveling. I have a passion. I do work from home, so therefore I'm able to travel and enjoy my life and enjoy my passions as well as work. Farmhouse, actually, the actual farmhouse, and this is uh, the 
time for Boulevard. Very famous, famous restaurant in San Francisco. And uh, grilled Wagyu short ribs. Wow. That's delicious. Look at that meat. Oh my gosh. Beautiful bread over there. Yeah, Wagyu. Wagyu short rib. Boulevard, San Francisco. Alright, so we got Nancy Oaks, Boulevard, Wagyu Beef. Oh, wow, it's delicious. Wow, that's delicious. Wagyu Beef. Oh, wow. We got Bruce Adele's. Alright, sausage. Famous, yeah. Wow, look at that, it's delicious. You're actually working. Yeah. Bruce Adele's Adele sausages, you guys all know that. Yeah, definitely, yeah. Uh... Okay. Yeah, you know, that's awesome. Let's go with the Adele sausage first. As you can see, it's delicious. It's like a little mini. They're very famous for sausages. Okay, it's juicy. Wow. I like that. The bun's great. The sausage is very moist and tender. The Dallas sauce is very famous. Pretty made. Wow. One, that's very delicious. So this watermelon drink that they crazy. Mm -hmm. That is delicious. You can see there. Wow! I'm not sure what's in it, but there we go. This is heaven if you let me. Boulevard, why you beef? Wow! Wow. Wow, that's delicious. Let's have this. Sorry about that. I couldn't cut it. I just went for it all. Just went for the whole uh, wide good beef. Well cooked, delicious boulevard. It's a restaurant that I had not checked out in San Francisco, but it's a place I've always been wanting to go. Wow. Now we're off to the sumo dog. Which, which one is this again? Bacon bun the bacon bomb me as you can see here it looks really really good so flavorful it's a bomb me sorry that's for tiktok follow me on tiktok guys let's try it oh wow This is delicious. Sumo dog. Oh my goodness. I've never had it before. It's so juicy. Wow.
I don't know why they're invited here. Bombing sumo that was amazing. Everything has been good, but we're gonna try some. What is this now? Jail salad? Wasabi, which I love, spicy. If you like spicy, comment below. Wasabi. Jail. Wow. Delicious. It tastes like wasabi for sure. Not too crazy in the spice, but it's good. What's this? This is the. This is actually the traditional sumo dog. This is the most popular one, I believe. It's called sumo dog. It has peppers. It has some seaweed. It has relish. Nice, I like the bun. The bun is real high quality. Wow. crazy how I would go to an event like this and spend you know, $350, or, I believe, or I got I gifted this for my sister, but hot dogs blow me away. It's a commoner. I amazing like it beef, but I'm blown away with the hot dog. Smash that like button. And subscribe. If you love food like me, if you love meat, subscribe. Here at Sumo Dog, oh, this place is amazing. Look at all that meat there, as you can see. Jeffrey Lanak, Sumo Dog, Bacon Bami Dog, and the Wasabi Potato Salad. Had all of it, it's just delicious. Definitely recommend checking this place out. It's a farm raised salmon. Mineral Fraser, Redford, wow. And uh, it's delicious. They raise their eggs at the, what they say is the purest water source on the planet. Okay. Which I uh, got to go experience firsthand a couple years ago. Okay. You can wow. see down in this pond, it's like trickles out of the bottom of the. Uh, I don't know where it comes from. It's our teeth and Yeah, okay. Oh, and then, that's um, amazing. Yeah, they raised their salmon in Penn, South uh, oh, okay. South Island, Nelson. Beautiful. But, uh, so it's beautiful here. Oh, that's yeah. beautiful. Yeah. yeah, consistency is always... Uh, Red bird. Right. You know, pink salmon or... Shooter plank or king salmon. Well, yeah, we go salmon. up to Alaska every year and fish king salmon. So yeah. I know what you're talking about. What do we got here? There's Nancy Silverton. Oh, wow. There's Nancy. The one and only Nancy Silverton. Oh, Nancy. 
Oh, oh my goodness, pleasure. I'm a big fan. They take a big picture if you don't mind. Thank you. It's amazing. Nancy Silverton's uh, Mozart group, obviously. Frito Pie, Nancy. Fancy. Uh, oh, I like how she did this. So creative. You put some. Wow. It's an event. We got blood cells, of course. Delicious. Bledsoe's is a staple. Tim Bledsoe in Los Angeles. It's traditional barbecue. Wow, look at that. Everyone's got the social. Wow. You want to sign that one or is that That is amazing. Look at that. What's up, Kev? You want to like go down the slice and go in the center now? Wow. Yeah, this is good, it's good. How long you guys cooked that in the smoker for? This one was about 16 hours. 16 hours. 15, 16 hours. 15, 16 hours. But it's a two-week process. Two-week process. So how does the process work? You, uh, that's obviously it. towards the end when you when you cook yeah, it. Obviously, you just grind it in a uh, pastrami grinder, and then you take it out, pat it dry, season it, put it on the pit. Amazing. How you guys doing? I hope you're hungry. Yes. Wow. Yeah. All right, hard barbecue. Yes. Come back for a second. Yeah. 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 Delicious. Hard barbecue. There we go. Thank you. You're welcome. Hard barbecue, Carby. Cucumber, boy. Yeah, the Silvertons. Oh my god, look at these sides. Corn on the cob, looks delicious. Baked beans. Park's barbecue, carby. Cucumber, boy. Okay, Park's Barbecue, obviously. You guys know how much, me being Korean, I'm being, I don't know, Mr. K-Town, I guess I'll kind of sell this taste. Let's see if this is my hands, obviously. Harvey's bent to eat with your hands. It's pretty good. It's typical Korean barbecue, it's typical Kari B. Um, this kind of reminds me of my mom, Scarby. Oh, I'll put the sum on here, and then, oh, I'm sorry. Oh, they put it together now. Well, let's put the bone here. Let's take the bone off, obviously. You know, get any pear, sangchu, you got lettuce. That's how traditionally how you eat Korean barbecue. Yeah, sometimes is really good. Let's try the cucumber oil. It's good. It's what I'm used to. It's in the garbage. When I'm in LA, I don't, I don't order garbage that often. It's much LA garbage. I use a kotsa or prime beef or jungshin. But yeah, it was very good. Now we're gonna move on to the host, Nanny Silverton. Um, we had a Warner 2014, obviously. Someone I admire, the Brea Bakery, I still love this, so go. And this was the Frida, what was this, I believe? 
Very interesting how she put it on a chip. It's like a nacho type of thing here. Wow, it is like a nacho. I love her. She did something very simple and very nice. And as you can know, she's very gracious. Uh, it's all about her friends, not about herself. Because this is a really good, delicious dish at the same time, but it's something over the top where. Hmm. It's really good. Wow. I do love these. Uh, most delicious uh, fruit chips I've ever had. Oh, so far, Boulevard, Lindell's, Sumo Dog, Parks. There's still quite a few more we have to go to. Wow, this is amazing. I'm going to shout out to my sister for giving these tickets. For me and my wife to enjoy this because this is a very tough ticket, exclusive ticket to, to get. To get. And the fact that it's open bar, this is great. The weather's perfect. Oh, it's really. There's so much good food. I just have to allocate my stomach, go around one time, and see what I like the most, and then double down on those places. But I have to get there first. Wow. Yeah, it's done a phenomenal job. I really like this. Very simple. This beef, some sour cream, and some frito chips. That's why she's amazing. Simple materials, but tastes delicious. And drinks too here. We did a virgin for my wife, but this watermelon is amazing. Alone. I don't know, this was like $350, I believe, per person, but open bar, I mean, the mixologists are amazing. They make great drinks, so. It's a great job. Sides. There's corn on the car, it looks delicious. Baked beans. Right after I can't give this to kids. They're like every while, like a pound of bacon. Alright, Neil Fisher's Redbird, wow. Salmon here. Sure it's some like sauce. It's delicious. Alright, the salmon. It's only salmon place actually here. All the beefs. I mean, I love wow, it's very delicious. I like the sauce. The salmon is very tender. It's very fresh. It's probably one of the best salmons I've had. Wow. It's very delicious. Some bledsoes here. As you can see, it's delicious. Got ribs. Got some pastrami. Got some sides. Big beans and potato. And all of a sudden, sauce on the side. Okay. Bledsoes. This is a classic. Came with my buddy. Uh, I know, I know. Wow. That's amazing. Did you get the coin. Excuse me? The coin. Good. Where did you get it? Oh, in the middle station over there. And the ribs are the same one from here? Yeah. The ribs are oh, yeah, they were good. Delicious. Wow. That's us. That was delicious. No. Enjoy the pastrami. Wow. Very good. The baked beans are delicious too. Mm. 
Man, I'll be coming back to Bledsoe for sure for some seconds. Delicious. Tender and moist. Perfectly cooked. Amazing. That's one of the best meats that I had out of this whole barbecue. Wow. I would say yours are the best. Thank you, thank you. And that's, that's some good competition here, too. Yeah, we've got some heavy hitters. Yeah, heavy hitters. But your place, where are you guys located at? We're up in San Inez area. San Inez. Uh, in a small town called Los Alamos. Los Alamos, okay. How do you say it here? It's Predite. Predite. Yeah, Predite, like, okay. Uh, Eastern European. And okay. People see it, and I've heard so many different things growing <laughs> up. Predite, wow. Probably the biggest taco I've ever had in my life. Ah, uh, yeah, we kind of <laughs> we kind of pushed the limit. That was good, was yeah. Taco. Yeah, that was amazing. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, I definitely check this place out. Look at this taco. Oh my god. Okay, I'm here to have uh, Nick Perdit Perdit's barbecue, oak smoked brisket taco look at the size of this taco it's insane that is massive look at the meat there's no utensils in here there's no utensils in here you need utensils? This is how to eat this. Huh. I'll eat this like this. I should know utensils eat this. Look at this. Oh my god. That is delicious. The meat is so tender. Wow. That fruit cake it is a monster taco. This is probably like a pound of meat. Oh my god. Wow, it's a little cool different from bread for sure. It's more on the tender side. It's fresh. This tortilla is amazing too. The sauce is great. Cilantro is really good. Wow. There's no need chances for this. Very impressed. Wow. Definitely memorable. Woo. I'm getting really full. I'm very sad that I don't have enough room. I don't think I finished this. It's so delicious. We we'll over. No. Definitely check out this place. Pretty barbecue. Wow. All right, what are my thoughts up at this place? It was amazing, man. Still became friends. It was very hospitable. Some of the things that I really highlight to this uh, food-wise was uh, Pradeet's uh, barbecue was amazing. The taco was delicious. Secondly was Sumo Dog, which I have right here. Uh, very full, but I'm going to have a little bit more. It was delicious. Uh, Bledsoe's barbecue, the stronger was out of this world. The Wagyu beef at Boulevard was delicious as well. And um, the salmon was very solid as well, too. Record. So those are four or five, half of them. Um, Super High Asking was the worst thing that didn't perform so well. I would say Parks Barbecue, the garbage was not that good. So I feel like that was kind of out of place in terms of the quality of food. Um, but other than that, all the other food was really good. But Parks Barbecue was, you know, obviously disgusting. Those are the worst by far. Um, amazing sides, amazing drinks. Uh, it's an amazing event. Uh, great event here at Hawaii Valley Inn. Uh, I just want to thank my sister Michelle for letting me come to this event and uh, she's giving her tickets to me and my wife so we we'll make this possible. Uh, this is a very tough ticket, like I mentioned earlier, if you get this uh, for foodies. It's like a foodies heaven. It's a heaven for people who love to eat meat. And uh, if you like this video, please like this, please follow, and I'll see you on the next one.